High temps and high humidity forecasted for this weekend. Now's the time to think safety. Heat related illnesses can creep up on you if you're not careful. Miles Hood got some advice from the experts. A heat dome across the eastern U.S. has Hampton Roads heating up. With temperatures expected in the high 90s this weekend, sunbathing all day may not be the best idea. Um, it starts as a heat rash, can be a sunburn, moves up to heat cramps, heat exhaustion, and then on to heat stroke. Zach Martin is an emergency room nurse at Centara. He says a bottle of water or even AC, if possible, is the best idea. For the people that can, obviously, stay out of the heat, um, stay hydrated with water. Temps expected above 93. Our own 13 News Now meteorologist Hunter Force explains why it may feel hotter than it is. The heat index is a measurement that takes into account the air temperature and the humidity, which allows us to determine how hot it actually feels to the human body. And when there's a lot of moisture in the atmosphere, our sweat can't evaporate, which allows our body to start to overheat. And that's why it actually feels hotter than what the actual air temperature is. And when our bodies overheat, bad things can happen. Heat cramps, um, muscle pain, spasms, heavy sweating um, during exercise, and it moves on from there to heat exhaustion. He says if you notice these signs, get medical help. Miles Hood, 13 News Now. Various cities have public libraries and community centers set up as cooling centers. We have a full list on 13newsnow.com. Just look for the featured section.